Hello guys. It is about, what, about 5.30? It's almost dark. I don't know if you see out the window. But um, I'll show you guys a little trick. So in Colombia, and I think a lot of Latin America, not only milk, but a lot of uh, drinks, they actually just put them in bags. It actually saves, saves time. So um, I only got two hands, so I'm gonna put this down for a second. I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna put it in here. Well, let me see if I can do it with one hand. Put it in here. So the first step is get your milk. And for a while I was like making a mess because I was actually pouring it into a container, but my maid told me a little trick. So you just put it in a container that it fits in like that. And I don't have scissors, but I do have a, um, I'm nail clippers. So do that. And I think I got it. Uh, well, that's easy as I thought it would be there. Anyway, here we go. Hold on. Kind of hard to do with one hand. If I had, I've done this before with two hands. It's pretty easy, but I, uh, anyway, well, yeah. I'm gonna put it down just for a second. Okay. And yeah, a lot easier with two hands. Hold it there. All right, so there you go. Now you see, I've got a hole. And as easy as can be, let's check this out. Pours right in, no mess at all. So if you guys ever are in Latin America and you have to buy milk, and yeah, first instinct is to like pour it in a container, but you don't have to do that. Just put the bag itself in a container. That way you don't ever have to, you don't ever have a container that's dirty either. So you don't have to wash the container, anything like that. You just put this in the fridge, it'll stay good for a while. And actually this bag, when you store it, you really don't have to put it in the refrigerator until you're ready to cool it down. And that bag, that, that milk will stay good for a couple weeks versus, you know, in the U.S. we got our milk. Uh, it only stays good for, you know, a week or so. This milk here will probably stay good for a month, um, you know, in the bag since it doesn't have any oxygen. But anyway, signing off, guys. So I'll give you a little informative little thing there. Um, if you're ever in um, Latin America, that's how you do it.